Hey guys, it's Madeline and happy holidays. It is officially the beginning of December and I am so excited. You guys are here today with a person who has been in my life for so long. This might be my longest friend ever. This is my childhood best friend, Stacy. We grew up together. She's a little dingbat like me. <laughs> so, got little cookie cutters. We are going to make gingerbread people today. I am really excited. I was just gonna do it for fun anyway. So here we are. Yes. Here we are. <laughs> It has yes. been 10 minutes of me trying to film this intro, and so we're just gonna make some people. <laughs> people. <laughs> okay, preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. So, vegan butter, brown sugar. I actually made gingerbread cake with my mom for really recently, which is really fun. Oh, I miss you, mom. Okay, guys, now's a really important time for us. We just need to take a moment of silence for all of the gingerbread lattes that we've lost this year. I think you can crank out a tear for this shot. My favorite thing about Stacey, you guys, is that she pity laughs everything I say. No, it's real! No. Tell them something fun about me from high school. Occasionally have a Russian accent. We're gonna just glaze right over that one. <laughs> okay, one half cup of brown sugar going in. And a fourth cup of vegan butter. Get in there. And now here's the fun part. My mixer and everything is in Vancouver. How are we gonna cream this together? I guess very quickly. Very quick arm movements. Do you feel confident in that one? Alright, well, I'm gonna sit here and whisk this together. It's only gonna take 20 years. <laughs> Eventually. Some of you the other day, like talking about, they use the word mental breakdown in the title of their video, and it made me so mad. I had actually had a mental breakdown that day, and I looked at it and I watched the whole video because I was like, you know, this is gonna make me feel a lot better, like watching somebody else have one too. I was like, you probably never had a mental breakdown in your life, and you're sitting here using it as like clickbait or something. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe yeah, not. language is important. But also, like, mental health is something that is not to be messed around with. And somebody like me who actually had had a mental breakdown that day and almost didn't get on my flight to New York. This is like very old school. This is like what happens when you don't read the recipe before you do it. <laughs> this is actually kind of creamy together though. It actually looks really good. When in doubt and you think you're not going to succeed, just try with the tools that you have at hand because sometimes it'll work out. Like right now. Okay, prepare your flax egg by mixing one tablespoon of flax meal with three tablespoons. It smells good. It smells, like, it smells like oatmeal. It does. It smells like oatmeal. Mm. Half teaspoon. Oh god. When I was making the gingerbread cake with my mom, I tried tasting it and I thought, oh, if it makes gingerbread taste so good, it must be good. The answer is no. Do not do that at home. Taste it. I tried tasting it. Do not do that at home. Taste it. All right, that's the third cup of molasses. Well. Flax egg is gonna go into the bowl. None of you guys are gonna taste these. So if the people who do taste these happen to have a chunk of butter or a giant chunk of brown sugar in it. Next step. And we have duct tape. <laughs> <laughs> Sift the flour. Yeah, right. Two cups of flour into there. I just did the salt and then I'm gonna do one teaspoon baking soda. I saw you in the nutcracker. Oh, you did go see me in the nutcracker. Yeah. I like my gingerbread cookies a little spicier, so I like to add just a little bit more spice to them. Nice heaping teaspoons of cinnamon. <laughs> Two teaspoons of ground sugar. I add all the dry ingredients into the mixing bowl containing the wet ingredients and mix it with the nut. Okay. But that's good. You feel like getting your hands in there or what? Oh my god, did you take any of your rings off first? The next step of the process. So right now our texture is a little dry, but I think that's normal. Have you baked a lot of gingerbread cookies or? Yeah, I made a lot of gingerbread families. Oh, all right, here it goes. This right. is really crumbly. I feel like we might have missed an ingredient here. I think it's just really too crumbly right now. What did we do wrong here? It is really crumbly. Why do I always do everything wrong? I don't know what to do. Is it not good? No, it tastes good. I might just eat raw dough until you figure it out. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm hmm I'm just gonna keep rolling it. Yeah, you can go. I think you're gonna eat all of it. Oh, it is really good though. That could have been Oh, that was good. Stacy? Yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh. Maybe. Should we put a little oil on our hands? This is gonna ruin it. How's that? 
Yeah. Kind of like massage it in to those cracks. Mm -hmm. I really just want to keep eating this dough. Yeah, it's really good. We're going to ruin this. Okay, it's not. <laughs> There's not even any oil in this recipe. I don't know why we thought this was a good idea. Look at all these pieces I have to eat. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's so good. It is. I think the flavor will be there. They are really just like crumbly though. Maybe a little more. The more that you break off, the more I'm going to eat. So you no. <laughs> We have to roll this out very soon. Oh, this is all for me? <laughs> <laughs> what if we form them into little balls and then roll them out individually? But this actually is working. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I saw that. What? You know what you did. That is working. This is gonna be so time consuming. That's good. I'm not even looking. First one. Are okay, we ready? Is First it one. <laughs> I want that rolly, 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 rolly. Right? That one song? That rolly, rolly song? Gingerbread cookie number two. And, and number three. three. We have a tree. <laughs> it fell apart. Oh my so god. Where did we do this? I'm just gonna keep eating this. You saw nothing. Why does mine look like that? <laughs> <laughs> it's like fell off. It's fine. The gingerbread is crumbling like my life. I don't know what we would have done if we wouldn't use the oil. So you know what? Things don't go your way. Improvise. Use oil. Always use oil. For everything. Everything. Brought to you by oil. I think people tend to be more mean online. I don't like that. We should all be nice to everybody. I don't understand that at all. Yeah. People were pretty mean to us in high school though, to be honest. Yeah. Middle school was rough for me. Yeah. Middle school was rough for me. High school was rough for me as well. <laughs> like I feel like our high school was meant for outcasts, yet I felt like an outcast. Yeah. I could get that. Wow. Should we have five more? Yeah. Ready? Oh, oh. <laughs> we have made eight cookies so far. <sighs> no! That's like Like the germs are just waiting. <laughs> I like the amounts of you. Remember that time we talked about how we were gonna open a bakery? <laughs> that would not have gone well. It's good. <laughs> it's good. Just, how does it get to the bottom? Oh my god. Remember the time we talked about how we were gonna open a bakery? Where's the tip? Yeah, it's here. That's okay. It smells so good. Oh, are they burning? <laughs> it's really bad. Oh, they're really burnt. Okay, oh, let's really burn. Out. We burned them. This is a disaster of a video. <laughs> I burnt that entire bat. We might have <laughs> up. Not what I had in mind. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, good's the operative term at this point. <laughs> It sucks because like the dough was so good and you encouraged me to stop eating it, but I think had I just continued, it would have been. It would have been way better than better. what we got here. <laughs> <laughs> when people do this on YouTube and they make it look so easy, I don't get it. I don't get it either. What about what's my icing on it? <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> Subscribe for weekly videos. I put videos out every single Wednesday. Sometimes it's okay to just accept that nothing has to be perfect and that this is life. Gingerbread like porn factory right here. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big old thumbs up. Subscribe for this gingerbread. I'll see you next week with another holiday themed video. And you know what? Today, or whenever you bake next, or whenever you do anything that doesn't work out for you, like this clearly didn't, just don't be so hard. Tasty, no matter that what. That is do. the message. Right?